Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlogmas video. So today I have a Sunday cleaning routine video for you guys. So I'm going to be sharing with you guys things that I like to get done on Sundays so I can start off my week on a good foot with a clean and organized house. Now some weekends I do have a lot more to do. Sometimes I have less to do. It just depends on how much I got done the previous days during the week. So I'm starting off in my kitchen. I am just unloading the dishwasher. I'm going to be picking up around the house. I am also going to be folding a lot of laundry, stuff like that. So I hope you guys enjoy today's cleaning video and I hope it gives you guys some motivation. So typically Sundays are the days that I don't cook. We usually eat out or order in, but we had ordered in the night prior, which was Saturday. So I did cook on this Sunday and I was just going to go ahead and marinate some chicken, leave it in the refrigerator for a few hours, and then I was going to bake it. So I'm just marinating my chicken and some seasoning, a little bit of olive oil, and also some barbecue sauce. I did try to pound the meat because it was just way too thick and I hate thick slices of chicken so I made it a little bit thinner so like you guys see right here I'm just seasoning with some seasoning I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil and also some barbecue sauce like I mentioned and I'm gonna let it marinate in the refrigerator for a few hours before baking it for dinner that night
So now moving on to laundry and clothes, I typically like to pick out the kids clothes for the week. So Sunday night, I will go through their closet and drawers and see what I would like them to wear that week for school. And if it needs to be ironed, I will iron it, hang it up and put it in the closet in the order I would like them to wear it that week for school. It just makes my life a little bit easier. That's one less thing I will have to worry about in the morning. So I do plan out all of their outfits. So this week I lucked out. None of Madison's clothes needed to be ironed. They were all pretty much already nice and neat. A few things were brand new with tags on it so they didn't need to be ironed as well. And then as far as Ryan's clothes, you guys aren't really going to see me picking out his clothes because I realized he didn't have any clean jeans. So I had to go ahead and do his laundry and by the time that laundry was done it was pretty late so I did not film myself picking out all of his clothes but I do pick out Ryan's clothes as well for the week. Next, I needed to go ahead and fold and hang up all of mine and my husband's clothes. This was the laundry that I did the previous day. I do try my very best to put all the laundry away immediately after I wash it on the same day instead of letting it just sit in the laundry basket. But honestly, some days I just don't get around to doing it. I don't have enough time. So I did have to do this on Sunday night. I had to fold and hang up our clothes. This is something I usually don't have to do on Sundays. But like I said, some days I just don't get around to doing it on the day that I actually wash wash the clothes. be doing is putting away my daughter's new wipes and diapers i like to put them in baskets in her closet i don't like putting like the big boxes in her closet so i do have a few little storage cubicles that i store them in i was also packing some diapers and wipes to send her to school with the teacher always asks for more diapers and more wipes i feel like madison goes through so much at school so i did have to pack her up quite a few diapers and wipes for the new school week all right, guys, so now that we are getting to the end of my Sunday clean with me, I just want to jump on here really quickly and say thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys found some motivation from this Sunday clean with me. Maybe I was able to motivate one of you guys to get a few things done in your house. I love to try and clean as much as possible and organize as much as possible on Sunday so that for the new week, I have a clean and organized house and I'm starting on a great foot. So thank you so much for watching today's Vlogmas cleaning video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you have not already. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. I love you guys and I will see you guys next time. Bye.